Beetles are insects that form the order Coleoptera, in the superorder Indopterygota. Their front pair of wings are hardened into wing cases, elytra, distinguishing them from most other insects. Coleopteran, any member of the insect order Coleoptera, consisting of the beetles and weevils. It is the largest order of insects, representing about 40% of the known insect species. Among the over 360,000 species of Coleoptera are many of the largest and most conspicuous insects, some of which also have brilliant metallic colors, showy patterns, or striking form. Beetles can usually be recognized by their two pairs of wings, the front pair is modified into horny covers, elytra, that hide the rear pair and most of the abdomen and usually meet down the back in a straight line. Coleoptera occur in nearly all climates. They may be divided into four groups, the first three, the Archostimata, the Adephaga, and the Myxophaga, contain relatively few families, the majority of beetles are placed in the fourth group, the Polyphaga. Beetles attract attention for many different reasons, including their economic importance, size, abundance, appearance, and remarkable habits. Several groups of beetles are among the few terrestrial animals capable of producing light. Members of several other families can produce sound. Most large beetles make a loud noise during flight, and many species, both large and small, are attracted to light at night. Some beetles attract attention by their bizarre habits, others do so by their grotesque forms. Many beetles have become adapted to an aquatic environment others live in association with ants and termites. Beetles are found in nearly all climates and latitudes, except in such extreme environments as those in Antarctica and at the highest altitudes. They are found on sub-Antarctic islands, close to the northern extremes in the Arctic, and on many mountain tops. Although many species occur in temperate environments, the number of species is greatest in the tropics. In general, individuals of a species are most abundant in temperate areas, and fewer individuals of more species are found in the tropics. Some species are solitary, others occur in aggregations. Predators such as the ground beetles are more apt to be found alone, as are many longhorn wood boring beetles and weevils, ladybugs, leaf beetles, pleasing fungus beetles, darkling beetles, checkered beetles, bis beetles, sap beetles, and some species of scarab beetles are often found in aggregations of one or several different species. Most families contain both widely distributed species and some with very limited ranges. Wide distribution in this sense refers to a zoogeographical or faunal region, limited distribution, to a single valley, plain, island, altitude zone, or vegetation type on a mountain. Size range and diversity of structure Coleoptera vary greatly in size, from a fraction of a millimeter to more than 200 millimeters, almost 8 inches, in length, for example, rhinoceros beetle, and up to 75 millimeters. 2.95 inches, in width diversity of structure among adult beetles is as great as range of size. The ground beetles have a rather generalized form, the flattened, oval body has a relatively even surface, with regular ridges or grooves, antennae and legs are of moderate length and slender. The underside of most water beetles is oval, smooth, and flattened, the antennae either short or very slender, and the forelegs short and the hind legs long and fringed with hairs that are used as paddles. Rove beetles have very short elytra and a slender abdomen. Soldier beetles, fireflies and netwing beetles have soft elytra. Click beetles have a hind-like joint in the body region called the thorax that enables them to snap their bodies and jump high in the air. Their relatives, the Buprestidae, metallic wood borers, cannot jump but take flight very quickly. Claridae, checkered beetles, are usually oblong or cylindrical, fairly active, and often brightly colored. Nitagilidae are short and flattened and have slightly shortened elytra. Coccinellidae are rounded, with a smooth, raised upper surface and a flat underside. The Indomicidae often have enlarged, rounded elytra. The Erotilidae are usually slender, smooth, and shiny, as are the Langaridae. Among the stout or cylindrical Lamellicons are a number of bizarre forms. The male, rhinoceros beetles have one or more horns on the head and sometimes on part of the thorax. 
Many of the true scarabs and other dung feeding groups of the Lamelicons also have horns, including some of the Goliath peoples. Male stag beetles have greatly enlarged mandibles, some are as long as the rest of the body. The chrysomlidae, leaf beetles, vary from simple egg-shaped forms to slender, flat, or wedge-shaped ones, with wide elytra in the tortoise beetles and often numerous spines or tubercles in the leaf-mining leaf beetles. The brachini are short and stumpy, with short stout legs. The head, slightly elongated in front, is similar to that of some curculeonid weevils. The cerambicidae, diverse in form and structure, usually have antennae that are longer than the body. Cerambicids may be slender and medium to large in size or very small. The extremely diverse tenebrinidae, darkling beetles, are not always recognized as members of one family. Most arboreal forms in the tropics or subtropics are slender and long-legged. Some slender and egg-shaped forms have a metallic sheen. Most of the ground-dwelling forms are black and robust. The large tropical trichnotomidae resemble some cerambicids, prinini, but are not related to them. The alaculini, comb clawed beetles, resemble some of the slender tenebrionids but are usually more active. Lagrini, lagrids, have a characteristic shape, usually widened behind, and sometimes a metallic sheen. Colidini hard-bodied and shiny or roughened, may be cylindrical and somewhat flat, 